Hi, this is Grandpa from Grammy Grandpa Read, and we're doing our Halloween books right now. So today we have a book, a Scooby-Doo special. It's called The Carnival Creep. It's by Sonia Sander and by illustrated by Duende Del Sur. Scooby and the gang had arrived at Owen's family carnival for a day of fun. Fred loved the carnival games, and Velma and Daphne enjoyed going on the rides. Shaggy and Scooby were especially excited about all the carnival food they were going to eat. Orville Owens and his sons, Otis and Oscar, were waiting for the gang at the ticket booth. Welcome to our carnival, Orville said. Well, soon it will be Oscar's carnival. He's taking over for me next season. How about we start our tour with the haunted house, asked Oscar. Roger the Rouse? Row Ray, cried Scooby. Like, like, count us out, said Shaggy. Scooby and, Scooby and I are heading for the fun house. Scooby and Shaggy had a great time in the fun house. They laughed as they posed and made silly faces in front of the mirrors that distorted their images. But while they were laughing at their reflections, a tall, scary, ogre-like creature appeared. It was the Carnival Creep, a monster who loves scaring carnival goers. Zoinks! Run, Scooby! cried Shaggy. Like, this place just went from Funsville to Creepsville. Scooby and Shaggy raced out of the fun house. The pair got away from the Carnival Creep and found their friends, who had just finished visiting the haunted house. Shaggy and Scooby told them what they had seen, but Fred, Velma, and Daphne thought it had was just part of the fun house until the gang heard screams coming from the Ferris wheel. They looked over to see the carnival creep was trying to climb it, jumping from one car to another and scaring the riders. People on the ground nearby quickly fled. Jeepers, it looks like there's a real carnival creep after all, said Daphne. The gang raced over to the Ferris wheel, but the creatures had disappeared. They saw Otis in the operator's booth. Otis, did you see the carnival creep, asked Velma. I'm afraid not, he said, wiping a green smudge from his neck. I've been too busy getting the wheel under control. As they left, Daphne saw a balled up mask and a costume near the booth. She wondered what they could possibly be doing there. Just then, Scooby and Shaggy showed up with giant cotton candy cones. They were so distracted by their food that Shaggy bumped right into Daphne. Oh, cried Daphne. Shaggy, you got cotton candy stuck in my hair. Now it's all sticky. Jinkies, that gave me an idea, said Velma. Let's spin a giant cotton candy web to catch the carnival creep. After some convincing and more cotton candy for them, Scooby and Shaggy agreed to be the monster's bait. They found the carnival creep by the concession stand and got it to chase them up the ladder of a big slide. Go faster, Scoob, cried Shaggy as the pair flew down the slide. Don't let that creepy carnival creep catch you. The rest of the gang were waiting below with the cotton candy web. Their trap worked. The carnival creep, all tied up in the sticky cotton candy, was surrounded by the gang. I know who you are, said Velma. The green makeup on your neck gave you away. Velma pulled off the mask to reveal Otis. You are you were jealous of your dad giving the carnival to Oscar instead of you, Daphne exclaimed. So you were scaring away all the customers. That's right. I would have gotten away with it if it weren't for you meddling kids, said Otis. The carnival would have closed and then I could have been the new owner. With the mystery solved, the gang could enjoy the rides and games. Oscar was so thankful they had saved the carnival that he let them skip all the lines and get free snacks. Scooby Dooby Doo! shouted Scooby. <laughs> I hope you liked that story. If you did, stay tuned for tomorrow.
at the, the one of the next videos is going to be the rock and roll zombie and also if you like this video smash the like button down below give us a big thumbs up subscribe to our channel most importantly and watch the playlist for scooby-doo and for halloween